Good morning everyone. It's another day here in Olu Denis and today we're going to be doing one of the popular attractions which is a boat tour. And right now we're on Olu Denis beach where we filmed the last videos. Got the paragliders right there. Beautiful beach. Yeah, extremely beautiful beach if you saw the last video. And if you didn't see it, check it out because we did the paragliding. It was awesome. And look at all these boats here. So look at those there, They're like uh, pirate ships. So those are the big tours, I think. We're going on one of these smaller boats and it's uh, 450 lira per person, with food included. Okay. Oh, next. No. Then it is now, step. Okay, yes. now, yeah. Now. Right. Whoa. <laughs> it's like you gotta walk the plank just to get on the boat. <laughs> All right, that's our boat. Okay, so we're gonna stay on the top deck here. Got loads of sunbeds. Absolutely scorching right now. Here's the other boats. They're all kind of the same, I think. But at least we got some shade at this part. Next to the captain, I think. <laughs> De definitely need this. 50. <laughs> So this is stop number one, really beautiful area here. So this is the sea, but they call it the freshwater spring because there's water coming from the underground there that comes from the mountains. Extremely beautiful color, just like everywhere in Old Denise. And yeah, I'm just loving the, the scenery. There's like a stony beach over there as well that you can swim to. I think we got 30 minutes here, right? Yeah. Now the guys are jumping from here. You gonna do it? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah. Double front flip. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm still a bit sick. Uh, I got like a sore throat the other day and I even lost my voice at one point, so I'm still recovering. So I don't think it's a good idea to go in the cold water yet. Cow's gonna have to have all the fun on this trip. <laughs> it's not COVID by the way. I did a COVID test and it was negative. It doesn't feel like COVID as well. It's a bit different to the last time that I got it. I can dip my feet at least on the, on the plank. Wow, this water looks amazing, doesn't it? Yeah, and it's funny because from, from parts it's very, very cold, and other parts it's not. So I think it's because, it's like the guy said, the fresh water. Yeah, the fresh water. Maybe that's colder than the sea. Uh huh. Yeah. And so beautiful. <laughs> it's a shame I'm not feeling too well. I'd be swimming around all over here. This is stop number two. This is called Camel Beach. Carol entered in style once again from the diving board. <laughs> so at least I can go to this beach without getting in the water. <laughs> yeah, so it's just a tiny beach, tiny pebbly beach. The big boats have come here, so yeah, loads of people over there. If we did the cheaper tours, that's the kind of boat you'll go on. Ours only has a few people. In case you're wondering, this is in July, the summer, and it was a holiday this week, a local holiday for the Turks, so we are expecting everywhere to be a lot busier today. But to be honest, it's not that bad at all. We have our space, seen places 
much much worse than this right yeah i think the other day in um in the blue lagoon i think it was the most packed uh, place we've ever been here in turkey <laughs> yeah it was yeah but this ain't bad at all it's pretty nice So we're back on the boat again, we've got the classic hits playing. All the places in Olodinese have these old school songs. Carol likes this song. It's a shame that my throat's bad, if not I would be able to sing it, sing it flawlessly. Yeah. Very beautiful voice you have. <laughs> Man, I'm in love with the landscapes of this coast though, the turquoise coast. Probably one of the best places that we've been for landscapes. That's Babadag up there where we went yesterday to the paragliding and for the sunset. And this is the first island that we've seen here. It looks like a rocky island. Don't know if there's any beach there. I'm not sure if we're going to be stopping here either. So it turns out that we are stopping on that island that I just mentioned. So this is going to be stop number three now. So this is called St. Nicholas Island. All good? Slippery. Slippery rocks. <laughs> yeah, it is slippery. Carol has found a, a good spot here in the shade. Natural shade. <laughs> so you can see these walls here. These are Byzantine walls. So all the way down, you can see different ruins. I think even in the water, can you see it? Like oh, the yeah. shape? Yeah, over here. Maybe that was for boats or something. So there's a sign back there explaining it that the Byzantines uh, lived here on this island until the 12th century. And if you go up the island, there's more ruins. I think there's churches and frescoes, but it's just too hot. The guy said it's too hot as well to walk up the hill. So he said it's best not to do it. So I think you said we got like an hour here. Yeah, I think in 45 minutes we need to go back to the boat so that we can have lunch. And then I don't know if we're gonna stay here more or just go to another island. Yeah, because this is number three, so we got two more spots. Yeah. I've never been but I imagine that area of like Croatia or Montenegro kind of looks like this from images that we've seen. Yeah, I think so since it's uh, also the Mediterranean coast. We want to go there because uh, everybody says it's beautiful. Maybe next year. Uh, yeah, maybe next year. <laughs> but we're going to somewhere in that area after Turkey. Yeah, <laughs> coming soon. So I think I might go in quickly, just a little bit. Too hard to resist looking at that. Just gotta watch out, all the rocks are so slippy around here. Whew. Luckily the water's pretty warm, so it shouldn't be too bad for me. So beautiful. <laughs> yeah, it's spectacular. Number four now. This one is called uh, Green Valley. Yeah, it's nice that all the spots are kind of different though. So here you got another pebbly beach. Oh, there's uh, like some ruins over there. Oh yeah, there's a ruin here. Another little rocky beach here. Oh, this is a nice spot for, for kids. 
So if you're someone that doesn't like being on boats for long, this is also a good tour because all the spots are very close to each other. I think it's only like, what, like seven, ten minutes between each yeah. spot. Yeah, it doesn't take long to get to the places and everywhere is just beautiful. Yeah, yeah I love this uh, turquoise coast. Yeah, that's what they call it, right? The turquoise coast or the uh -huh. Turkish Riviera. Yeah, you can see why turquoise. <laughs> yeah, everything is turquoise around here. So that was the island we were on just there. San Nicolas and all of the news is just behind that so yeah it's all just in this area right here I wonder if Turkey's gonna have anywhere that we think is nicer than this. It's kind of hard to imagine. Yeah, because uh, especially all of the Nice that has that big mountain, and that's very impressive. I'm looking at it right now, it's like, wow, crazy. And I'm not sure if there's gonna be another place uh, as impressive as here. Yeah, this is gonna take some beating, that's for sure. So this is the second to last stop, so it turns out that we're going to stop in six places instead. People are jumping all the way from up there. Interesting like big cave here. Gonna jump Carol? No, for sure. No chance. <laughs> All right, this is going to be the last stop now. This is called Aquarium Bay. I don't know if it's because the water's like an aquarium. So the plank is raised now. I'm going to jump. Wow, it's very high actually. <laughs> Now we're back in Olodiniz once again. It only gets dark at what, like 8.30 or something? Yeah, I think Well that's sunset time, dark dark, it's like 9.30. Nine. <laughs> yeah. But I think we're done with the sun for today. <laughs> yeah, we had a lot of sun. <laughs> it was an amazing tour though, wasn't it? Yeah, Definitely worth it. Very nice and affordable, I would say. Uh, just enjoyed it a lot. Yes, I didn't mention before, but they did pick us up from our hotel, so they're going to give us a lift back to the hotel now. That was included in the price. Carol, it is kind of tempting to stay on this beach though. <laughs> Looking how nice it is. So 
that's going to be it for this video. We're just pretty tired from the boat tour. And we did a lot of things yesterday, so... Yeah, we're just gonna relax here. And this is gonna be our last video from Ola Denise. So, absolutely love this place. Probably one of the coolest beach destinations that we've ever been to in the world. Just love the landscapes and yeah, the water's just beautiful everywhere. And I just like the town and the atmosphere in general. And the fact that you can do like the paragliding, which is very different. I haven't really been to a beach place before where there's people paragliding all the time. And our next video is gonna be from a place called Kaz. I think the locals pronounce it as Cash, and it's gonna be more of an authentic beach town. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting seeing how a more traditional looking beach place is here in Turkey. So if you like the video, just drop a like to support us. Subscribe to like to see more videos like this one. Follow us on Facebook and Instagram, and we'll see you in the next one.